All right, welcome back to more Kingdom Come Deliverance. In the last video, we found Riki. He was hiding out in this cave. And then a couple of bandits came looking for him and we helped him. Well, well, we, well, we defended him. <laughs> and then we let him go. So, we didn't really do our job like what we were supposed to. But, maybe he'll help us out later in the game. I don't know. But, we're going to hear it from Bernard. Definitely, when we get back. So, um, you might notice this, the... The HUD looks a little bit different. I actually installed a couple of mods to this game. This one's called uh, Clean Hub. Just gets rid of a lot of the, a lot of uh, the graphics on the screen, so you can just just see the what you need to see. Like there's no, there isn't even any uh, map anymore. <laughs> Every time I have to go look at the map, I'll have to hit M, but. Yeah, this compass thing at the top screen should should be good enough, I think. And uh, also, I installed a mod that's called Double XP or More XP or something, and uh, basically just makes it easier to level up your skills. Like the one I chose is uh, Double XP, so every time I I gain experience in a certain certain skill, it'll just multiplied by two so it just makes it faster to level up and stuff like that and I figured that I think that's a good way to play this game if you're just doing a let's play of it but yeah let's uh let's get the hell out of here we can actually go do this quest now find the ring in the hidden hidden in the executioner's house and steal it we have a bunch of lock picks like we have like Five. So, yeah, we could go do that. I don't really want to go see Bernard. He's gonna just gonna yell at us <laughs> for not for not bringing Riki in. Inquire after Timmy at the windmill. I mean, we're pretty close to that. We could go to Tamburg and then. Head south. I think that might be. Oh no, we could go to Ladechko. Yeah, yeah, let's go do that. Let us fast travel. There we go. All right, let's head. Wait, what time is it? I think it's pretty late. Let's see. It's almost midnight. Might as well just stay here tonight. Do we have a bed? Yeah. We'll take a... We'll have a little nap. We'll do it. We'll start first thing in the morning. Get out of my way. It's your fault. Glad I got the reshade. I also got one that was uh, called Optimization oh, Horsemanship. New perk available. And I got this mod called Optimization. It just makes the game run better. <laughs> it didn't seem like it while we were in that city, but it's supposed to make the game run better. 
Heavy duty pony. Horses can carry more, but is slower, but can't be combined with race horse perk. Your horse is faster, but carries less weight. Can't be combined with... Uh, Alright. <laughs> I kind of use my horse as a, a mule anyways, so I might as well get this. It's going to be slower, but... I guess we'll just have to... Use fast travel more. Wait, I'm going the right way. <laughs> Damn it, I'm not going the right way. I'm going the exact opposite. his breath. Is this? It's a traitor. God! Get out of my way. to inquire about Timmy. That's what the <laughs> that's what the quest is. Good day to you. I'm looking for Do Timmy. You know Timmy. He's a big man and um... a complete numbskull? Aye. He works here, or he used to. I'm not sure. He vanished a few days ago. As far as I know, no one's seen him since. But try asking his sister Mirka. She works here too. This is her. Yeah. I'm looking for a Colossus by the name of Timmy. I heard he works here. Colossus, I, I like that. I don't know anyone like that. We will try to. S yeah, we'll use this one. Listen, someone wants to kill him. I have to warn him. My God. So it's true then. That idiot's got himself mixed up in something dangerous again. All right, but not him. We'll talk round the back, behind the mill. Here I am. So... Why all the secrecy? What do you want from Timmy? Can you tell me where to find him? Promise me nothing will happen to him. Why do you care so much? He's my brother. He's not very smart, you see. And he's always getting led astray by his no-good friends. And now there's some right peculiar characters looking for him. Who are they? I don't know. But they look like cutthroats. And they said some strange things. But I didn't tell them anything. That's good. But sooner or later they'll find him anyway. Tell me where he is and I'll take care of him. He's hiding at the Colburn farm over by Merhoyed. Oh. oh shit.
Alright, I'm ready for this. Four on one. I've got the feeling oh, no. you're looking for someone here. I thought I was about to I'm fight them. For someone too. Maybe we could help each other. Hmm. And who are you looking for? A great big ox by the name of Timmy. <laughs> I'm looking for him That's too. Interesting. I'm also looking for a big ox called Timmy. Well, what are the chances? Could it be the same fellow, I wonder? Now, if someone were to tell me where to find Timmy, I might offer that man a job. We could use a smart fellow like that at the camp. He's in Rate. I want money. I hear he's hiding in Ratai. Oh, yeah? Where in Ratai? He's at the butchers. They're his kin. Well, excuse me if I take that with a grain of salt. <laughs> I'll just leave Radan here to keep an eye on you. For your own protection, you know. Come with us if you've got the stomach for it. If not, come and find us in the Samapesh Tavern when it's all over. Or we'll find you. Nice. Come on, boys. Radan. Don't fucking annoy me. <laughs> Should Don't I fucking annoy me? Should I kill this guy? Is he gonna follow me? Yeah. I told him that Timmy was all the way over here. So we got a lot of time. Gotta go that way. If he's gonna follow me, I'm gonna might have to kill him. Yeah, we'll go this way. It's my companion now. Wonder if he's gonna help us fight. have to go through through the town well, this place is fancy oh no oh. turn around I wonder if the guy I wonder if Radon is still f following us Radin? Could be Radin or Radon. <laughs> I don't know. These names, I don't know. God! All right, we're almost there. God! My. Who the hell was that? Heard somebody say, My good man. Alright, so you should be around here somewhere. Oh! No. Good health to you. Is there a fellow called Timmy around here? Yep. He turned up a few days ago, so we took him on as a farmhand. He won't last long, though. He's as strong as a pair of oxen, but twice as dumb. He can't lay a finger on anything without breaking it. Timmy. <laughs> hey, stop talking. What the hell? Stop. There we go. Hey, Timmy. How are you today? I'm all right. Uh, have we met? We have now. Huh? Oh, shit. Shit. What do you want? It wasn't me. I didn't... I mean... Shit. I saw what you did at Neuhof. What are you talking about? You weren't there. I, I mean, I wasn't there. Don't waste your breath. You were there with Limpy Lubosch and Riki. I heard all about it. What do you want from me? Your mate Hinek told me about a whole camp full of those horse hunts. 
and I want to find it. I need to find it. Yeah, but... But why should I trust you, though? I'm not stupid. You might be one of them. Pretending to not be one of them. Trying to catch me out. I won't tell you nothing. Could give him money, spit it out, or, I'll, or else. We'll try this. Why would I be trying to catch you out? Why would I be trying to catch you out? For Christ's sake, man. They crucified Limpy Lubosh and Ujit. What the hell are you trying to pull here? Shit, 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 shit. What will I do? Shit. I don't know where their camp is. That's a load of horse shit. Hinek told me you were there and that Pius wanted you to keep your mouth shut. You must know something. Well, once I was there with them, yeah. Only, I was pretty drunk, so I'm not too sure. Try to remember. It was in the woods. In some kind of woods. You know, with uh, trees and stuff. There were some wrecked houses there and all. In the woods. A, a church. There was a church there. Kind of a broken one, though. Oh, great. Thanks a lot. Now it's all clear to me. <sighs> Do you remember which way you went? It was straight north from Talmberg. When you go uphill... From the castle, there's a path there, round some barns, I think. It leads to the woodcutter's camp. If you go further on past the woodcutters, you come across this abandoned house. Can't miss it. Looks like a house, <laughs> only abandoned. Go to the left there, and carry on till you come to this clearing, with a big beech tree. Or was it an oak? Uh, you go left there again, there's this narrow path, and you go straight along there. Sometimes it splits up. You just keep to the left until you come to a crossroads by this big flat rock. You keep straight on there. After a while, you'll see a bridge. And it's right there. Easy as you please. Better than nothing, I suppose. I can't remember but any, you won't anything tell he said. About Neuhoff, right? You promised. Oh no, bugger! I meant to make you promise, but I forgot. You have to confess. I won't tell. Don't worry. But in future, find some other way to make money, like honest work. Thanks. I'll, I'll try. On account of my sister, at least. That girl at the windmill. Hi. Mirka, did you talk to her? What did she say? She told me you're as thick as a fence post and always getting dragged into some mischief. Did she? Yeah, she's probably right. <laughs> Alright, we gotta go talk to Radzik and tell him about the location. Radzik is all the way not over there. Oh, he's over here. Okay. I thought he was still at Neuhof. How about a little bit? Wait, what did that guy say? You know, let's go talk to him really quick. As a gambling man, let's talk. Riddler. How about a small wager, my good man? That depends. A wager over what? It's simple. I tell you a riddle. If you solve it, you get back twice the sum you wager. If you don't, I get to keep your coin. That sounds good. Let's do it. Let's try it. Now, listen carefully. In the feast hall, on the table are ten candles. Suddenly, a gust of wind throws open the window and blows out two candles. A little later, another candle goes out. The servant, therefore, closes the hall window 
but now the wind cannot blow out any more. So how many candles can the servant find to relight the following morning in the hall? Shit. I think seven. I could be wrong. Oh no, she she, she has to re relight them, so she has to relit three. Yeah. Three. Is the correct yes. answer. While the wind blows out three, seven burn down completely overnight. So the next day, only those three can be rekindled. Yeah. Well, what can I do? Here's your ten groschen. Spend them as best you can. <laughs> Maybe we'll meet up again sometime. We may well do so. Nice. Thank you. to wash up before I talk to him. There. The Lord be praised. What brings you to me? I have some news about the investigation, sir. Good. Tell me. I went to Ujid's where they told me I could find Lubosh. Only someone had murdered him. It seems they're trying to cover their tracks and get rid of witnesses. Indeed. The whole affair is becoming ever more suspicious. Have you any further clues? I found out about another one of them. A crony of Limpy Lubosh's. They call him Riki and he comes from Nadechko. You're doing a good job, but you need to be careful. Have you found this Riki fellow? Brunt is behind it. I'm afraid my news isn't good, sir. Hmm. I might have expected as much. Tell me the worst. This Riki fellow was hiding out in the woods, and his former accomplices really did want to kill him, because he, Limpy Lubosh, and others deserted them in Neuhof. It seems they wanted no part in the killing. Anyway, Riki told me they were hired by a bandit they call Runt. He's the one who stole your sword. Those murdering whoresons weren't after loot. They just wanted to do damage. And the worst thing is, they have an encampment in the area, and they're getting ready to make more trouble. Sacra. Anything else? That's all I've found out so far, sir. All right. Come back and report to me as soon as you learn anything new. About that encampment, sir. What is it, lad? I found out about the camp from another of the bandits who deserted. He's called Timmy. Big fellow, but more brawn than brain. The camp is an abandoned village in the woods to the west of Talmberg. Good work, lad. Have you been to check it out? Do you know how many of them there are? I don't know much apart from where it is. We really need to find out more. Could you go back there and try to discover anything that could help us in the assault? The more we know, the better. And if you could carry out some sabotage while you're in there, it would be invaluable. But don't take any unnecessary risks. I don't want to lose you. Certainly, sir. That is... I'll do what I can. That's what I like to hear. You'll be our eyes and ears, lad. Our success will depend on what you find out. Go, and get back here as soon as you can. Meanwhile, I'll muster my men. I'll find out what I can and be right back. Nice. Might as well go there right now. Wait, how close are we? No, we're pretty far. I wanted to go do this quest, but... Maybe when we're in the area later... We'll go do it, but... Yeah, let's... Fast travel to Tomberg.
don't see anybody yet. Alright, now these guys are good guys, so we don't have to worry about them. Go to the fork with the ruined cabin. There's a fork in the road right there. Alright, here's the ruined cabin. Go straight ahead to the next fork by clearing by clearing with a big beech tree. Oh, I hear somebody. Are those bandits? I think so. Here. Oh, shit. I, I can't, I can't fight these guys. They have like full armor on. Oh, they tackled me. Ah! Ow. Alright. Shit. I'm I'm out of here. That's not that's a fight I cannot win. And I'm bleeding too. And I think I'm dead. I think I should just die in this reload. Yeah. Yeah, shit. This time we're not. We'll just, like, not get off the horse and just run right past them. Yeah, screw you guys. Take a left and continue on the path to the next fork. Take a left and carry on. It's starting to get really narrow. Might have to get off the horse pretty soon. Carry on straight at the crossroads all the way to the camp. Too close, too close. Right, wait, let's take off all of our gear so we're not so loud. See, we have 100 for noise. So we'll get rid of... Start outer layer. Alright, so we took off all of our gear. So we should be really quiet. And... A moat. It would take a while to get across, and there's nowhere to shelter from arrows. Look around the camp and see what could be useful information for the attack. A stockade. A handful of men could hold it for quite a while. Go back to Sir Razik. I could. 
but I kind of want to try poisoning poisoning these guys first. I don't have any poison, <laughs> but let's see. 